a final send-off fitting for a man described as an icon. The life and contributions of the late Winston Cassius Clare Yearwood was celebrated during a service of thanksgiving at the chapel of Coral Ridge Memorial Gardens. Yearwood, who was born on September 20th, 1945, passed away on June 7th. Friend and entertainer Richard Stolt says Cassius was far better than what he was accepted for. He remembers him for his humor. One of the things I remember about Cassius is he introduced me to his beautiful wife from Guyana. And I said, Cassius, where did you meet such a beautiful wife? He said, I met her in the after dark. <laughs> so, 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 you know, to me, that was memorable. I mean, you couldn't beat that. You know, then they, he had the band called Eggs. I said, but why do you name the band Eggs? He said, because when they break up, everybody will know they'll break up. An egg break easily. And you know, he just was a very humorous kind of person. One night they played in, the, in, the, in front of courts. They had this, this show, and you had the eggs that they playing, and he loved James Brown. He loved James Brown to death. And he had this band doing everything that James Brown would do. For those paying tribute to Cassius, it was an honor to know him. Former Chief Justice of Barbados, Sir David Simmons, says Cassius was grateful for the assistance and role his father played in his life. My father was the principal of the schools, and he and Cassius forged a valued relationship. Cassius never tired of paying tribute publicly to my parents for assisting in his rehabilitation. And as some of you may have seen on CBC TV recently, one of the highlights of his life occurred on the 1st of January 2001 when he and I both received the Barbados and 10 year honor for our contributions as builders of Barbados in the previous 50 years. Sister Stella Gibbons says her brother contributed significantly to young people. She says she is proud of him. In his life, he attempted some strange and dangerous skills. He always thought that you had to follow your dreams to make them come true. And his motto was, if it don't kill you, it will make you stronger. Winston Yewa Cassius Clay, OBE, BCH, last performance and retirement party was held on May the 8th, 2019 at the Harbor Light Dinner Show where he worked for many years. God bless you. Go safely into heaven, my brother. May he rest in peace. Kishmar Sanjis, CBC News.